After death, the body loses around a stone. I've experienced this firsthand, but why? Some folks say it's the weight of the soul. What do you think? Hi, my name's Tracy and I'm a mortician. And I'm Trish and I'm not. And welcome back to another episode of... Are you dying to know? Of course, Trish is dying to know. I am. Yay. I am today. There's an interesting one today. Yay. Hello, everybody. How hello, are you? Hello, hello. And who is this? Oh, oh. He's got the blues. Oh, Cal. He's looking good though. I don't think he's got sad blues. I think he's got happy he blues. Suit, blue suits him. It suits you too. Oh, you guys. Yeah. I didn't get the memo. No one told me about the blue day. <sighs> Sorry. It's a blue kind of day. These people are going to take over and go off on their own without me. <laughs> they didn't tell me about the uniform. Anyway, Cal looks gorgeous. It does look good, sure. yes. He's been a bit quiet lately in our videos. He has. Yeah, I think we need to get him out and about. He needs to get back out. Yeah. He needs to get back And maybe this is the start of him rocking yeah, it again. maybe. Yay. Come on, Cal, get your mojo back, buddy. Yeah, get your mojo. Okay, so today we've got an interesting one. Yes. Today we're going to talk about a little comment rather than a question that came to us from Mark. Hello, Mark. Hi. How are you? And um, Mark says, here's an interesting one, girls. After death, the body loses around a stone. I've experienced this firsthand, but why? Some folks say it's the weight of the soul. What do you think? Hmm. What does everyone out there think? I've, I've never experienced You've that. But never... then I wouldn't really, I wouldn't really know. Because you don't really, well, I wouldn't wear a body before the death. I, you know, and... We have weird bodies before because um, crematoriums sometimes need to know weight, uh, especially for larger people for in the coffin size and the way the coffin the body. But no, not all of the time. So interesting um, to know how Mark's experienced it. So yeah. what the circumstances around that. Mm -hmm. But um, regardless of that, there is a thing. There's a an idea that the soul weighs 21 grand. It was the title of a movie back in 2003. Yeah, yeah I didn't see the movie, but I remember yeah. the concept. Um, and I googled it, so I'm just on Wiki. Uh, but Wiki tells me that um, there was a dude called Duncan, McDo Duncan McDougall, mm -hmm. and he was from Massachusetts, the place that we can't say. Oh, Massachusetts. Yes. <laughs> um, and he did some experiments because he had this idea that bodies lost weight after death, and that was the soul leaving the body. Right. And then. Um, did a few experiments to try and back that up, but his research was never really um, given any credence because he didn't do it on enough subjects right. and the evidence was a bit inconclusive. So what he did was he actually found patients who were close to death right. in a hospital situation and he particularly found people who were very infirmed close to death, so they would be still. Ah. And so what they did was they actually weighed the hospital bed on industrial scales right, yeah. and mm -hmm. got a weight and then waited till the people passed away and then got another weight. Um, he was trying to prove that humans had souls but animals did not. Right. So he then went about weighing some animals before and after death. He was going to weigh some dogs. Right. Um, but apparently, according to Wikipedia, he couldn't find any, and so it's believed that he actually poisoned them to do the experiment, which is a pretty abhorrent, I reckon. Oh. But that's just my personal opinion. Oh. No. So anyway, still inconclusive. Yeah. Um, and then some other people did some stuff, and you know, there were some people that weighed some sheep, goats, and rams before and after death, and found that they actually put weight on after death. Okay. Um, oh, well, well, and then that's... lost it again, but like me moments, not days of decomposition. Mm, okay, gonna say because yeah. ascites and edema and all that will equate to putting on weight because you're filling with water and fluids. But isn't that already coming out of your body? Like, well, I suppose it's coming out of your yeah. cells, isn't it? It's it already is. there. It's already in your cells. Yeah. I suppose. Anyway, neither of us are very scientific. Oh, I'm sorry. Scientific. You should ask your husband. He knows about this stuff. Yeah. Well, not this stuff, but cells and stuff. Yeah. Maybe. So. Um. But anyway, yeah. So it was not ever, ever proven, and they don't actually mention the weight of a stone. That's mm. heavy, so I don't it's know. Stone, yeah, I don't know about stone, that. Heavy, yeah. But, uh, yeah. What are your okay. thoughts around that, like the time of death business? We've talked about it before. Actually, we talked about it recently, didn't we? Yeah. I, 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 my opinion is like I, I don't feel comfortable touching the body straight away after death. Just I, I, I just feel like 
it, I obviously must feel and believe that the soul is there and it takes some time to go away. So I prefer not to um, handle the deceased until it's settled, until it, they've gone. But as in weight and stuff, I don't know. I really have no idea. That's not something that comes from movies or anything. That's no. just a deep feeling, yeah, in it's you, just, isn't it? Yeah, it's a deep feeling. The body is still very warm, and I find that quite unnerving because I just think that they haven't gone yet. You know, I, I know they have, and there's no signs of life and everything, but I just feel that they haven't gone completely. And that maybe is just the soul, yeah, waiting for that soul to leave. But, but yeah, um, as in the way thing, I've, I've no. never come across it's that. It's interesting. So. If anyone else knows anything yeah. about that, any yeah. actual real research that um, or experiences like Mark's had yeah, absolutely, um, about yeah. that, we'd be interested to hear more about yeah, it. Yeah, definitely. It's kind of out of the realm a little bit, but still yeah. within the realm. Yeah, yeah. But it's interesting. It's all very interesting. It'd be great. All right. Well, thanks for sending that yeah, in, Mark. You've got you, it us all Mark. thinking. Yeah, you yeah. have. Oh, <laughs> Hope yes. you're well. Yes, and, I do. Um, Everyone else, hope you're well too. Yes, take care. <laughs> like, subscribe, tell your friends. Till next time. Bye. Bye-bye.